and Cabron looked as magnificent as ever. It's good to see the council so engaged. I'm, ex I'm eager and excited to hear today's discussions. Hey, you heard about the new guy coming today? This seems quite impressive. Yes, I heard he's low lineage. His abilities are said to be extraordinary. Hmm, what's the excitement about? Is there something I should know? Solarizing, you say? I suppose we should prepare for the welcome. <laughs> As the dragon settled, the cavern's entrance burst open with a blaze of golden light. Solarizing, a striking dragon with radiant golden skills and fire and majestic wings, makes his entrance. Greetings, great dragons of dragon adventures. I am Solarizing, the gold metallic sun god with glass colors. It is an honor to join your esteemed ranks. Uh, welcome, Solarizing. I am Hexalis, leader of the council. Uh, your entrance is indeed spectacular. Thank you. Look at the flames, they're magnificent. So amazing, you're already my favorite. Mm. Well, it's always good to have new and powerful allies. I trust you fitting well. As the council meets progresses, it becomes clear that the Soul Rising has captivated the attention of every dragon present. His golden flame and his confident demeanor has been and made him an instant favorite, overshadowing Hexalius, who once held that prize. I've always been a player of strength for Draconia. It is truly so easy for me to forget the value of experience and leadership. I've noticed you've been distant lately. Is everything alright? <sighs> just your dumb arrival has overshadowed me. The admiration and attention you're receiving are overwhelming. Remember, your leadership has been invaluable. It's not just about being in the spotlight. It's about the impact you make. You're right. I've guided Draconia through many trials. I shouldn't let one newcomer's radiance make me doubt my worth. Focus on your strengths and the role you play. My shown presence doesn't dismiss your con contributions. As the council continues to celebrate Soul Rising's achievements, Hexalius finds solace and realizing being competitive is bad. However, the feelings of jealousy and insecurity linger, shaping his perspective on future. Hexalius observing the admiration receives his smile faltering. It seems like that Soul Rising has quickly become the center of attention. I should have anticipated this. Rise and flames are incredible. They're unlike anything you've seen before. I've never seen a dragon command such beauty so swiftly. It's as if he was born to shine. I suppose it's natural for the council to be drawn to new and impressive talents, but I've led them through many challenges. I hope they remember that. Is something troubling you, Exalius? If there is anything I can do to assist or support, please let me know. Uh, no, Solar and I appreciate the offer. I'm just ensuring everything runs smoothly. Welcome once again to Dragon Adventures. As the days went past by, the dragons focus remain on Solar Rising's remarkable abilities. Hexalius feel increasingly sidelined. His previous status as the most revered dragon, diminishing as Solar Rising's brilliance captured everyone's admiration. The Grand Camber of Dragon Adventures, a few years later, the atmosphere is tense, with dragons murmuring about the recent changes and ongoing tensions. It seems like we have another new arrival. I wonder who this one would be, you see. Behold! Volcamus! The Red Giant has arrived! What? Well, huh? It's good to see you. Your presence is quite dramatic, as always. Except as my old friend, I see the council still thrives. I've heard the, of the recent changes and came to lend my strength. And what brings you here, Volcamus? Another dragon to join the ranks? I come with no intention of overshadowing anyone. My aim is to contribute and support not to compete. Let's not jump to conclusions. We shall welcome Volcamus and see how can enhance on our council. Greetings, esteemed dragons and dragon adventures. I'm the spirit. I'm seeking to join your alliance and contribute my unique abilities. Another newcomer? What makes you think we need your help? I bring a different perspective and skills that may complement your strengths. I hope to be in service rather than cause of vision. It's going to be a challenge to manage these new dynamics. Let's try to foster cooperation and understanding. The darkening sky and the arrival of the Cosmo. The grand cavern of Dragon Adventures, where a sky above turns dark and red. The blood moon rising ominously. A sense of foreboding fills the air as the powerful presence approaches. I'm Cosmos. Cosmic Souverine. 
I come with the intent to unite, not to dominate. This dragon, his presence is overwhelming. What does he want from us? Cosmos, your arrival was pretty unexpected. What is your purpose in Dragon Adventures? I have observed your struggles and wish to lend my powers for the protection and enhancement of your realm. My intentions are to unite, not to dominate. Another powerful dragon claiming to offer assistance. How do we know you're not here to take spotlight? I seek no control. My goal is to support and uplift. I understand your concerns and I hope to prove my sincerity through your action. These cosmic powers have already shown their worth. Perhaps this will help us forge a stronger alliance. I suppose his abilities are impressive and his intentions do seem genuine. It might be worth interrogating him into our council. If we can work together, even with a different power and perspectives, we can strengthen our realm. Despite their initial reservations, the dragons start to see that the benefits of having Cosmos go on with them. The atmosphere in the Grand Cavern begins to shift from one of the competition to collaboration. Like, it's clear that while we faced initial resistance, Cosmos' contributions are proving to be beneficial. Our strength lies in our unity and ability to adapt. With each new dragon, we are learning to work together and appreciate the diverse strengths we all are bringing. I agree. It's important to embrace the changes and recognize that every dragon has a role to play in our council. I'm excited about the future. Our combined abilities will make us stronger than ever. The dragon's perceptions of cosmos begin to shift as they experience the positive effects of its cosmic powers. They start to appreciate the value of unity and collaboration. The arrival of the Quatona and Quetzalcoatli, the Grand Cavern of Draconia, AKA Dragon Ventures, a week later, the atmosphere is still vibrant from the recent changes, but a new sense of anticipation fills the air as new dragons approach. Hello everyone, I'm Quatona and I can clone myself. Welcome Quatona, it's always good to see someone eager to join us. My cloning abilities can be quite useful. I hope to contribute to the council in meaningful ways. I'm so excited to be here. Cloning, you say? That's an interesting ability. I wonder how it'll fit with the rest of us. It sounds like, like it could be quite handy. Let's see what you can bring to the table. See, I can create several several copies of myself to help with tasks, gather information, or simply add more to our effort. I am Quizzalokli, the Swift. I come to bring agility and speed to your realm. Quetzalcoatl, welcome. Your arrival is quite spectacular. We've seen many faces lately, but your abilities are more remarkable. Huh. <laughs> well, thank you, Hexalius. I've been heard about your growing council, and I want to add my skills to your ranks. Speed and agility can be my powerful assets. It seems like every new arrival is making a grand entrance these days. How do you plan to integrate with us? I'm here to support and collaborate. My speed can complement the strengths of others, and together we can achieve more. It's clear that your ability could be more useful. Let's work together and see how we can make them. As we continue to welcome new members, let's remember that each dragon brings unique qualities to our council. It's our diversity that strengthens us. It's remarkable how our council is revolving. Each new arrival brings something special, and I'm optimistic about what we can achieve together. The dynamic with the Grand Cavern starts to shift with the arrival of Quatona and Quetzalcoatl. The council becomes more vibrant and diverse, with each dragon contributing their unique abilities. Despite the changes and challenges, our council remains strong. Let's continue to support each other and build a cohesive alliance. Unity and Transformation the Grand Cavern of Dragon Adventures. A few months later, the atmosphere is one of the harmony and collaborations as the council members continue to strengthen their alliances. We face many challenges as a welcome and many new faces. Our unity has welcomed and became our greatest strength. Uh -huh. Each of us has contributed our unique abilities and together we created a powerful alliance. The integration of our new members has been smooth. Our combined strengths and our presence. I'm thrilled with how well we've been working together, and my clones have been able to assist in numerous ways. And 
my speed has helped us achieve many goals more efficiently. It's amazing to see what we can accomplish together. Our diversity has truly become our strength. We managed to turn our differences into assets. It's been a journey of growth and transformation. Our council is now stronger and more cohesive than ever. The Grand Cavern resonates with our harmonious energy symbolizing the council's unity and the strength they have achieved through their combined efforts. The dragons of Dragon Adventures continue to thrive. Their bond is unbreakable and their future is bright. Yet ahead, it is just the beginning.